Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick, and like I said in my last video, um, I'm going to show you guys my new team lineup. I'm really excited about this team. I'm really happy about it. There's only about three more cards that I want before it is fully complete, and I would be happy with this team for pretty much a while, like two or three months before I'd want to get some new cards. So let's take a look at it. Uh, so my offensive line, I made a huge upgrade. I uh, got Michael Roos uh, and... Anthony or Adam Levitre? It's Adam Levitre. Andy Levitre. God, I'm stupid. Marquise Pouncey, Kevin Zeitler, and Orlando Franklin. Uh, those are just kind of. That's my new offensive line. I kept Tolbert. Uh, he does perfectly fine. And then Emmett. I did have Thurman Thomas for a while, but um, went back to Emmett. Pass offense. I got Des Bryant. Uh, my uh, cover vote pack that I got for next gen was Calvin, which is stupid because. You got a free Calvin and a Drew Brees, so that's kind of retarded. And then I got Deshaun Jackson. Uh, still rocking the BCA Gates and, of course, rocking Vic. I really wish I could have gotten the cover vote Vic because that would have solved a lot of problems here. But whatever. Defensive front, much better than the last time you saw my uh, team. Uh, so we got Greg Hardy, Gerald McCoy, Barry Cofield, yeah. uh, Sean Phillips, Whitney Merciless, uh, Daryl Smith, Mason Foster, and Gerard Mayo. I really like my uh, defensive front, but this is the part I like about my team the most is coming up. Um, my secondary, I love. Once I get uh, Brian Dawkins back or put Eric Berry, there's a couple of people that I would put there and I'd be perfectly happy with. My secondary will be complete, so get ready for it. Check it out. Got the limited edition Joe Hayden. Uh, spent the 210k on it. Got a good number that I wanted was number 7. There's a number 4 up now, but that's not really a number I want. Uh, when I get under 10, I want 1, 3, 5, 7. Uh, and I got 7, so I was happy about that. Uh, picked up a keep to leave man defense for 30k. Uh, pretty boss. You guys know I love to press, so I gotta get at least 90 press. And uh, 89 is good enough for... Uh, Joe Hayden, he hasn't been burned yet. Uh, Leon Hall, uh, 94 press, so he's he's a boss. Uh, not I think he's so cheap because not too many people know about Leon Hall. Um, I know him uh, from Michigan and whatnot. He's one of my favorite uh, one of my favorite corners, so that's why I picked him up. Uh, we also got Woodson, the captain Woodson, um, who has just played like a champion for me. I wish he was Mandy; uh, would help out a lot. Uh, let me kind of uh, have a little bit weirder of a team. I wouldn't have to have so much man uh, defense chemistry, guys. And then I got Rashad Jones just because he is man defense. And I had him before. He plays really well, uh, despite the fact that his zone coverage is only 86 and his play rec is only 71. He does play amazing. Um, I've had no problems with him. Uh, specialists, still Robbie Gold and Andy Lee. Uh, still uh, Andy Lee. Uh, for my kickoff starter, Max Unger. I went with the center uh, for my long snapper. I don't really think that matters. Um, let me know if it does. Let me know if you've had any problem with some lower end long snappers. Um, and then, of course, I got Trent and Holiday returning kicks. Right now, I'm using Jim Swartz uh, just simply because of the long pass. But as soon as I can get the Megatron, or actually, once I get Megatron, because that's who I really want. Um, I won't need them anymore, um, and then I'll have three Megatrons. I don't know what I'm going to do with that whole situation. Um, I won't have to have Jim Swartz. I can go with a man defense probably and kind of mess around with uh, my secondary. Or my... Oh, sorry. I had to yawn. My bad. Um, I can mess around with the front here. Maybe get some guys that aren't man defense chemistry. Um, and then I'm using the Patriots jerseys, playing at Qualcomm Stadium, and using my same playbooks that I've used all year. Uh, so let's take a quick look at my team, what kind of players I have on it. Let's see, players, QBs, so I'm rocking the Drew Brees, the cover vote. I've got Terrell Pryor, the week one fantasy, and Vic, halfbacks, Emmett. I pulled the Bobby Rainey. Uh, CJ Spiller and the free AP, fullback Tolbert, wide receivers Dez, the two Calvins, Deshaun, Tavon Austin, Trendon Holiday, tight ends Gates and Gronk, the free Gronk, left tackle Roos, Baker, left guard Levitre, center Pouncey and Unger, uh, right guard Zeitler and Dell, 
or however you say it. I think it's Harvey Dahl, Dale, but it could be Dahl, or yeah, there's a lot of ways you could say that. Uh, Orlando Franklin, Andre Smith, Greg Hardy, Sean Phillips, and Chandler Jones. D-tackle, Gerald McCoy, Barry Cofield, uh, William Perry. Left outside linebacker, Whitney Merciless, Suggs, and Harrison. I don't know. I got those most fear cards. I don't know what I want to do with them. Probably, I don't know. They're not worth a whole lot. So I might as well skip on my team for now. Middle linebacker, Daryl Smith, Mason Foster, and D'Amico Ryans. Right outside linebacker, Mayo and Danny Trevathan. Corners, Hayden, Tlaib, Leon Hall, Pat Pete, Tracy Porter, Brandon Boykin, and Dominique Rogers, Crow Marty. Free safety, Woodson and Reed. Strong safety, Rashad Jones. And the rookie, Brian Dawkins. Kicker, Gold, and Andy Le uh, Lee. Um, but something new maybe that you guys didn't know is if you search up, actually I want to search up this, but uh, it, it works for any card. But if you look up this, it's free safety, and you go this away, uh, you can see the number, please tell me he's still up. Yeah, there he, no, no, oh, there he is, there he is, the limited edition update Charles Woodson. Flip him over, you can actually see the number, which he's number 10 out of 25. Something something simple that they actually added to the game, which is quite nice. Um, I think it's dumb that they uh, took this long to add the ability to look at the number. Um, we didn't have it last year. We didn't have it early this year. Do we even have it in 12? We didn't have it at all, I don't think, ever. And so it's just a really nice because then if you get, like, number 23 or 24... Per se, you can put it up for more, and people will be more apt to buy the good numbers, and then the people who have the sucky numbers are going to have to put them a little bit cheaper, so it just adds a little bit more of a cool aspect to the numbers, uh, plays into what number you get more than uh, before. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Drop a like if you did, subscribe if you haven't, and I will catch you guys later. Peace out.